Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Estela Nina, a food and lifestyle vlogger based in the UK. For my returning subscribers, thank you very much for tuning into my channel. Thank you for always commenting and liking. And if you're clicking for the first time, please click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so whenever I upload a new video, you will be notified. Today we are going to make corn and beans porridge, also known as corn chaff. It is a meal commonly eaten in most parts of Africa and in Cameroon in particular. So our ingredients are corn, beans, tomatoes, red oil, onion, ginger, garlic, parsley, spring onion, spring onion, and celery. And we also have some maggi cube and some salt to taste. Some fish as our protein. So let's get into the cooking. At this level, we are going to continue our cooking with a voiceover. We wash our corn and our beans and put them in different pots and put it on the fire to cook for an hour 15 minutes and an hour 30 minutes respectively. While the pot is on the fire cooking, we'll go ahead to cut and chop our tomatoes and our onions. When it's all chopped, and an hour 15 minutes later, our beans is ready and it's taken off the fire. We, and the corn too is ready an hour 30 minutes later. We go ahead to wash our beans. We wash it thoroughly compared to how we wash in Cameroon because we don't throw the water that much. But this one, because it's stored with um, a lot of preservatives to keep it longer, so we have to wash it thoroughly before we go ahead to continue with our cooking. Same with the corn, it's supposed to be washed thoroughly before we go ahead to continue with our cooking. When our corn and our beans are all thoroughly washed, we put our pot on the fire, add in our red oil. When the oil is hot, we go in with our onion. We stir fry, fry our onion for some time. We add in salt to the stir fried onion. Then we go in with some salt to taste in the stir fried onion. We add in our tomatoes and it continues frying. Our tomatoes are all fried. When it starts sticking to the pot, that means it's ready. So now we go in with our blended spices and some water. And for our blended spices, we still have a bit of onion in it, spring onion in it, a bit of celery and parsley blended with ginger, garlic, and our country onion. All of it is blended. So after we've added that, we go in with our seasoning cube and leave it to boil up. 10 minutes later, our pot is all boiled and all the spices are well cooked. So we're going with our already cooked corn and beans. We stir it. Till everything is well mixed, the spices and the corn and the beans. We cover it to cook for another 15 minutes. And it is all cooked. So we go in with the rest of our ingredients, which is the chopped celery and the parsley. 
Uh, this one, I like putting it the last thing because it gives another flavor and aroma to our corn and beans porridge. And our meal is ready and good to be served. Thank you very much for watching to the end. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. See you in my next video. Bye.